Russian rockets rained down on Kyiv on Thursday, the blasts shattering windows at this psychiatric hospital. No patients or staff were harmed, but for Dr. Nelia Kirnes, the attack was traumatic. She lost her home to an airstrike last February. Time does not heal. All this flashed in my soul, in my thoughts. All this was recalled. I would not wish this on anyone. It is very hard to experience, to endure. She carries mental and physical scars from the attack in the early days of the war. And the house was damaged, and I was wounded by shards. Unfortunately, the flat burned down. The house burned down, everything in the flat. I miraculously, thank God, survived. Thursday's bombardment was fierce, even by the standards of this conflict, that has seen Russian forces pummel Ukrainian cities. Hanadi Zyberblad is head of Kyiv region's Psycho-Narcological Medical Association. And I saw two smoke trails over there, first one trail and then the other. I'm assuming one missile flew and then the second, or two missiles or two anti-missiles. You see the shrapnel cut the branch. Around 150 personnel and 468 patients were there at the time and remained indoors. Cyberblad said, thankfully, the psychiatric patients didn't panic. But for Kiernis, the attack was almost too much to bear. It is very hard to cope hearing that kind of noise of shattering glass. Russia denies deliberately targeting civilians. Ukraine's military said it had shot down 54 missiles out of 69 launched by Russia in the latest volley. Air raid sirens rang out across Ukraine for five hours in Kyiv. 